the late British Army captain, Sir Tom Moore, is getting his very own film. The 100-year-old veteran became an inspirational figure during the pandemic after walking 100 laps in his garden. Do you remember that? I do, and who can forget, of course, he raised over £32 million for NHS charities and sadly died in 2021. Production is expected to start this autumn with shoots in the UK, Thailand and Barbados. Well, Hannah Ingram Moore, the late veteran's daughter, joins us now. Good morning to you, Hannah. Really, really good uh, to have you with us this morning. We can see that really beautiful image of your father behind you being knighted by the Queen, I believe. Mm -hmm. It's not quite clear from here, but I yeah. think that's what it is. Uh, so good to see you this morning, Hannah. What is your reaction to this biopic being made about your father's life? Well, good morning. Yes, this incredible photograph behind me of that amazing day. I think I'll take you back to the moment when my father was told people um, wanted to make a film about him. He couldn't believe it. He genuinely couldn't believe it. He was staggered and had such fun thinking about who would play him. But most importantly, what he wanted to know was who was going to play young Tom. Um, and we're thrilled, of course, that this is coming to pass. And as a family, we just couldn't be prouder. And, of course, um, some of the locations, quite exotic as well as Britain, Thailand and Barbados mentioned there. This is to kind of portray um, Captain Tom's earlier life in the military, right? I mean, he got around. Well, he certainly did. And um, uh, his formative years um, in the army, fighting for freedom for all of us in Europe, but most importantly, he was uh, fighting in Burma, um, fighting the Japanese. And um, unfortunately, they can't film on location in Burma, so they'll be filming in Thailand. And um, with wonderful images behind of just some of the most spectacular days of his life. He lived a hundred wonderful, rich years full of love, life, laughter and loss. And um, finally, when they film in Barbados, it will be because that was the last family holiday we had together, which was truly the most magical time together that we had. Are you really pleased that you had that time in Barbados with your father? Because I know at the time there was some concern, wasn't there, about his age and about his health. But for you, you feel as though you had those memories and, and that precious time with him. Absolutely. And, and he, it was on his bucket list. He wanted to go to Barbados and meet the cricketers. Um, and he was signed off with a good bill of health before we went. Of course, we wouldn't have gone if, if he wasn't well. But honestly, what I can tell you is we sat together as a five, just having the most incredible time together. He sat and watched his um, two youngest grandchildren be, play on the beach. Georgia, who was then 12, running in and out of the sea. He got a bit of a suntan. And um, wherever we, he went, people uh, just wanted to love him and take photographs of him. It was magical. Um, Hannah, um, two questions. Um, how involved are you in the production of the movie? And, of course, the big question on everybody's lips, is there any speculation about who's going to play Captain Sir Tom the Legend? We're not involved in the production. Um, that is with uh, Fred Films and, and their other teams. And, um, yes, speculation runs wild. What I can tell you is that my father was very clear about who he wanted to play um, young Tom. Um, he wanted Spider-Man to play him, Tom Holland. And um, he made that really clear. He said, I'm not so worried about the old Tom. Who's going to play the young Tom? So mm. there, that's what I can tell you. Oh, Super. and do you have any idea of who would play you, Hannah? <laughs> oh, no, it makes me squirm to think about that. No, not at all. <laughs> oh, it's so it's so crazy to think, isn't it? Your family are going to be in a film and yeah. a, a life as legendary as your father. What do your children make of it, Hannah? Oh, just pride. R remember that um, Benji, who's now 19, was three when my father moved in and Georgia was born a year after that she knew nothing else than living with her grandfather. So they are just, I mean, thrilled for him, thrilled for the legacy, thrilled for the memory. And what fun, ultimately, to um, imagine that there's a film about your grandfather. Just incredible. And, and Hannah, um, movies can take a long while to make. Do we have any idea at all about when we can expect to be able to see this movie? I think it all depends. It depends on timing, actors' availability, the weather. 
Um, but let's hope that it should be um, available in 2024, let's say at the, the latter end. But unfortunately, that's not for me to say. Oh, well, Hannah, we really look forward to seeing it when it comes out, as I'm sure people up and down the nation will feel exactly the same way. As you say, Captain Sir Tom Moore, what a legend. And so many people will remember that, that beautiful image behind you, him being knighted by Her Majesty, the late yeah. Queen Elizabeth II, and, of course, the laps around the garden. What a legend. Great news that a film is being made about his life. Thank you so much for joining us.